PC helper here and in today's video I'll be talking about how to fix is done.dll and arc.dll error for the game control. Control is a great game and it has been getting some great reviews lately. So I have a few possible workarounds and I'm sure if you stick till the end of the video this problem will be solved. So let's get started. So the first workaround is clean booting your PC. Clean booting your PC is really simple. I've already made a complete guide on how to clean boot your PC. All you have to do is click on the upper right corner of your screen. There will be a card appearing here. You can access that video by clicking here. Or you can find the link of that video in the description of this video. So this is the video on how to clean boot your PC. Only of 2 minutes 45 seconds. It's a quick guide. And it's by PC Helper. That's my channel only. So that's it for the first step. After clean booting your PC, you can proceed to the second step. So second step is disabling your antivirus. This is a really important step because disabling your antivirus can really solve this issue that is done.dll. So mainly it's the antivirus that stops the game from installing. So there are many antiviruses. So Windows Defender is the antivirus that is inbuilt in Windows PC. So I'll show you how to disable Windows Defender. Just search for Defender. And now go to Vice and Threat Protection. Wait for it to load and yes here it is by and threat protection settings click on manage settings so here in real time protection turn it off so once you turn it off your vice and threat protection is turned off so you can in start installing your game and most probably it will work but if it doesn't proceed to the third step first step is changing the priority of the setup to high so i have not downloaded the game control on the pc i am using for recording so I'll show you how to do the same with the game vampire with the setup of the game vampire so there won't be a problem with this game because it's same for all the games so just listen carefully third and the fourth step are the most important ones so this is the third step so just open the setup of your game control it will open like this for as it's for vampire game so you have to do the same with game control now right click on the taskbar and go to task manager and here on setup right click and go to details here you, here you will find setup.exe or this the name might be different all you have to do is just right click on the process that's used for the game control and go to its details so the highlighted part it's setup.tmp here set its priority to high I also change the priority of setup.exe to high so the name of the file might not be setup for the game control it might be different it might be control.exe or might be control setup.exe all you have to do is identify that and just right click on it and change its priority to high so that's it for the third step now we'll be proceeding to the fourth step so the fourth step is one of the most important step again and this step will be changing name of the setup folder and we'll be changing the installation directory so i'll be showing you for the game vampire again you have to do with same with the setup of the game control so right click on the setup folder and click on rename and change its name to anything else for you it might be control repack or control setup you can change it to control repack one just control but change its default name to something else and not be doing it again because I've already changed the default name it was not vampire repack I've changed it to vampire repack so once you change the name then open the setup of your game I'll do it now click on ok so the layout might be different for the game control but the steps will be same so click on next you can limit install to 2 gb of ram if you have 8 gb of ram or less next next and here it is so by default the directory is c drive program files 86 and somewhere in the c drive all you have to do is change it from c drive and browse it in d drive or any other drive you have and if you only have c drive just change the directory to somewhere else from the default location so i have a d alternate drive like d drive so i'll change it to d drive games vampire and ok so once you change the directory now most probably your game will not show your setup will not show is done.dll error and that might fix your issue but if not proceed to the fifth step now let's come to the fifth and the last step that is downloading is done.dll and arc.dll just go to your web browser, search for isdem.dll, click on this first link by dllfiles.com and once you click on that link, you will be redirected to this page. So once you are this, on this page, just download it. Nevertheless, whatever your 
bit version is if you are 64 bit if you are 64 bit pc then also the 32 bit version will work so don't worry about that so once isdn.dll is downloaded search for download anag.dll click on this first link again then you will be redirected to this page and again bit and version is 32 bit but it will work fine on 64 bit version it's same for both the versions and click on download so now you have downloaded both isdn.dll and anag.dll error or not error files now go to a download folder and search for isdn here it is isdn and go to this file click on this and extract to so if you have a 64 bit pc you have to go to c drive windows and in windows search for syswow64 folder and extract it to extract it here but if you have a 32 bit pc go to system32 and extract it here so you have to go to c windows and if, a, if you have a 64 bit pc extract it to syswow64 but 32 bit users have to extract it to syswow64 so you have to click on ok here and it will be extracted i've already extracted so i won't be doing again you have to do the same with an arc.dll file that is an arc here it is click on this file and extract it to acer c windows and syswow64 as i'm a 64 bit user and click on ok and I won't be replacing because I've already downloaded this file and extracted it there. So that's it for the last step and I'm sure once you perform all the 5 steps your problem will be solved. So that's it for this video. If you like this video please hit the like button below and also comment if you have any query related to this video and also don't forget to subscribe for more. Thank you and have a nice day.